Hi guys, Rob here with Deluxe Gaming, and welcome back to my Beyond Soul series, episode 8. And guess what? It's patch day again! Actually, it was on July 21st, they updated again to 8.03. And this looks like a really good one, so let's just read through this really quickly. This week, we made a bunch of tweaks to the economic and diplomatic balance of the game. We added a new diplo diplomacy option, trade treaties, that should give you another tool for building reputation with AI cities. We also added our first new Tekla ship, which should mix things up when deciding to build your fleet. Stay tuned for a new Exeter ship next week, as well as new diplomatic options. So this new ship that is coming from Tekla now, so you have to have a Tekla uh, building up to, upgraded to level three. Well, actually, it's a support cruiser, so it'll actually give you shields. It'll transfer shields from its ship to your ship, which is really, really cool. Also, these trade treaties. So. Uh, over and above actually uh, g giving you money, it will actually improve relations too. So I'm actually excited to try both of those. Also, they've made it now, so it's <laughs> funny because last time we were having troubles with this, it's now easier to destroy smaller cities. So what it means now is if a city is below 50 in population or power, what I think it's population, um, if it's below 50, it won't automatically offer you a truce and then force you to stop the fight. So that's kind of cool. So it'll make it a lot easier to destroy those small cities. Um, and let's see, rebalanced uh, income penalties for having negative population. So what was happening is if you had a really, 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 really big city and you had even minus one population, um, because that minus one, it, it would, it would, it's, it's relative to the size of the city, minus one population in a really big city uh, mattered way more than minus one population in a really small city. So they've kind of rebalanced that so it's not so crazy so that the, the penalty wouldn't be as bad. But anyway, so I'm really excited to try this. Let's get back into our game. Hopefully it works. I haven't actually tried it yet. Crossing my fingers, crossing my fingers. Sounds good. Sounds good. Okay. Yes, here we are. All right, let's dock. And uh, yeah, so actually, I'm just curious what our city is at 99, 99, I guess that's, is that population? I think that's population is what that means. Yeah, population 99, fleet active 19 in reserve. Oh, so it's not 19 ships, it's 19 command points in reserve. So if we look at Crydon, it's, he's got 24 active in reserve or 24 active, which is the size of pretty much uh, the entire, the entire size of my entire fleet, um, including my reserve. And 84 in reserve. Okay, so he's probably got, what, 12 ships, maybe? Something like that. And they've also, yeah, so, haha, uh, he's got two borders with us now. That's a problem. Two borders down here. Oh, yeah, they are definitely going to be a problem. <gasps> okay, actually, let's, uh, <laughs> without further ado, let's just get this show on the road. Let's go to the market here. And uh, what are we at? Huh? Oh, yeah, we've got lots of room. Let's just store a whole bunch of minerals. And then we'll go out and we'll do some missions really quickly and then maybe we'll go attacking some bases and doing that thing that we'd like to do all the time which is you know get crazy and violent <laughs> ah so fun and actually let's uh do we want to take ships with us yeah that's always good to take ships with us i think uh and now i really want to upgrade our tecla to three that's gonna cost a fortune though oh right we can't take that level two i guess we'll take the level one i guess that's all we can do right now we need to improve the size of our hangars in order to improve that so let's go get this first because it's there oh, there's a comet Ooh, distress signal oh. ah so much to do so little time i like to start out uh, each each uh each episode kind of doing a couple basic missions and then we kind of go into attack mode Ooh, outpost i think these two are in uh, they're they're at war right now. Uh, I don't know if I can actually see that here. Uh, let's see here. Oh, oh, they are hostile. This city is hostile. Okay, actually, let's let's go do our thing first. <laughs> uh, get, easy to get distracted. Yeah, there we go. Excellent, excellent. Anything else here? No, I don't think so. We'll do another little circle around. But I think that was pretty much it. Yes, I like your little fleet, actually. It's it's looking pretty good. Oh, something else I wanted to try. Actually, let's dock quickly at this. What did I do? I just hit a button. I hit the F button. No, I hit the R button. <laughs> Whoops, I uh, didn't mean to do that. Um, so, uh, so who was it? Wone, Wone, one of the uh, viewers, uh, one of my viewers of the uh, channel and of the series had mentioned, uh, had asked whether or not we could actually put duplicates of any of the weapons in our bar here so like we could have twin missile launchers and stuff with our own individual cooldown so that'd be kind of cool peace treaty valdor agreed to peace treaty with kylar so they are over here somewhere 
All right, hold on. I want to try this first. Oh, oh, oh. where's our city? There we are. <laughs> Sometimes uh, we're a little off. Oh, another battle. Is that really close by? Hold on. Uh, let's dock first. And I just want to see where that battle is. Oh, that's quite close by. Okay, so let's just check this out first. So let's go to loadout. Um, the question was whether or not we could like put two missile launchers and then they would both have... No, so you can only put, oh, bummer, yeah, it's too bad. Good idea, Wone. I like well, I like where you're going with that. That way, you, you know, because I really like the missile launchers and I really like the plasmas, for example. So we could have two plasmas and two missiles with and be able to fire two missiles at a time. That'd be really cool. But we cannot do that. So let's get out of here. Let's go, uh, let's go, let's go to this battle. This looks interesting. Okay, away we go. I wonder if it, these missions do start getting harder over time. A lot of people, or a couple people, were talking about uh, the tipping point in the game. And that's where the game actually starts to get really easy. Like, you start to get really powerful, and no matter what anybody else does, uh, you pretty much won the game. Uh, I gotta remember how to fight again! Here we go. Oh yeah, no problem. So yeah, we just gotta defend these guys. Ah, uh, yes. Oh, that Missile. Probably too far away. Oh, there we go. Awesome. Too far. Come here. Come here! Uh, missile! Oh, any better! Oh, yes! Nice! Should have grabbed that other thing. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful fight, guys. Well done. Well done, team. Well done. Slow down here. There we go. Grab this. Ah, uh, we're getting pretty... I think the amount of money... Oh, what's this? Uh, city uh, reputation with Crydon. So Crydon are the guys that are right close. And we need all the reputation we can with them because we have two borders, which is not good. Oh, look at all these juicy minerals. Jumping to the minerals. Can't help myself. <laughs> Easy money. Easy money. Yeah, we are hold. Yeah, we could use a ship upgrade pretty soon, I think, too, as well. But I, I really want to upgrade the uh, Tekla Corporation. Uh, I, and I think we just need, yeah, we need money and minerals for that. So, yeah, this is this is important. Collecting all these minerals will help that uh, process. Okay. Oh, there's more down here. Oh, turn, turn, turn. This thing does not turn on a dime. dime. <laughs> there's more up north, too, so we'll go grab that. That's the thing, when you're in the nebulas and stuff, you have no radar, so you can't really see what's going on. It'd be cool if, you know, I'm, I'm thinking that, you know, that those that, that's the kind of thing that we'll see as ship systems eventually, uh, when they get added to the game, is is, the, uh, is have scanners so that you can scan uh, or use a radar in nebulas and stuff like that, I'm sure. I have no doubt. I think I missed one there. Oh well. Whatever! Whatever, dude. Alright, perfect. There's one. Thorium. Yeah, so somebody also, um, and I apologize, I don't remember who says what all the time. I do read all the comments, so in case you're wondering, if I ever don't respond to you, it's not because I don't care. I do care. <laughs> I try to respond to everybody, but I can't always do that. Um, I just don't have time <laughs> normally. I try to respond to as many people as I can. But yeah, somebody else was mentioning that um, the prices in the larger cities are generally worse than the prices in these smaller cities. So if you're going to go sell some stuff, um, go sell in the smaller cities because they need them more. Apparently. Uh, ooh, a game tip. If your city goes into negative population, power or hangar space, your income drops significantly. Of course, we knew that. Uh, Mars and Crydon are now at PCS. Yeah, so they were actually at war. Okay, they're not anymore, which is nice. I mean, I'd rather they be at war. I'd rather other people be at war all the time. I just That's my preference. Um, maybe we before we dock at home, we'll go take over a couple more sectors because I think uh, that's important. Let's beat up these guys first. Locked on target. Ah! <laughs> Love getting that first missile hit. That's always uh, handy. Come here! Come here! Now, I've noticed that they don't use missiles on me all that often probably a good thing. I think the bigger ships do. But uh, so far, haven't seen that big of ships yet. I'm assuming they're going to get bigger. <laughs> much, much bigger. I'm hoping like Star Destroyer size is what I would expect, you know. Look at all my guys. They're so eager. I love them. They're great. Perfect, freighter captain. 3,000 bucks. Thank you very much. 
Money received. Ooh. I guess we gotta go heal. Uh, actually, before we go heal, let's go take over a couple more sectors. Because uh, we should be getting to a point where we can reasonably expect to upgrade our command center. I think it's called command center or control center. Because we're, we've got enough income to pull it off now, I think, uh, without too much trouble. I guess we can close that one. And we're going to be building a radar station here. want to take over this sector. Oh, I closed it for some reason. Oh, there we go. Uh, another radar station. Yes, please. And we have another... Yeah, we have enough for another one. Let's go build one here. Uh, we should go get that comet, too, before we head back. And then we'll go heal. Then we'll go stir up some trouble. Ooh, uh... Valerium declared war on Al Zahisha. Where is that? That's probably nowhere near me. Uh, uh, Valerium. Oh, yeah, it's up there. That's fine. That's fine. You guys fight all you want. I don't want to mess around in these asteroid fields because we could get attacked at any time. I know I'm missing. Hold on. I should get that stuff too as well. Radar station done. Excellent. Perfect. And do we have enough for another one? Should we take? Yeah, we should grab another one. Why not? Why not? Let's go get this one, too. Jump. While we're here. You know, that every one of these, like, gives us, I don't know, like, three, four hundred or something? Pretty good, actually. And we could start upgrading them, but, uh, you know, I think... Lots of starships floating around. Hey, we can... Oh, right, we gotta go take out those, uh... <laughs> the, the pirate base. We... Oh, that's another thing that, that uh, they've uh, improved in this version, is that pirate bases give you more, more loot. So I want to be sure that we've got a nice, clean, empty hole before we do that. Uh, should we go sell at New Brazil? You know, New Brazil isn't really a threat. I don't want to kill them now. I'm, I'm, I'm past being mad at them. It would be easier to kill them. Actually, no, let's, let's go. We've got to go home. Um, it'll be easier to kill them now because they're small and uh, they, they no longer have the, the ability to surrender and stop the battle. <laughs> if they're under 50, which is kind of cool. Um, but uh, I'm more worried about Crystal City. They are going to start... Oh, uh-oh. Uh, Vakrim... Crystal City on Halkai. Where They're attacking Halkai. Where, where are they? They're over here. Okay, so maybe we should just... Uh, but they're so big right now. I don't want... Oh, man. Okay, we, we just need to... We need to do our thing here. Let's dock. Whoops. Dock. There we go. And repair. Oh, there's so much going on. It's hard to keep track of all the stuff that's going on, actually. It's crazy. Uh, Peace Treaty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so repair ships. Let's go to... Uh, what do we need in our city? So I think we're okay for most things. Uh, let's upgrade our Tekla if we can. We need uh, nine more uranium. Okay, so let's deal with that. Let's get uh, uh, ten. We'll go by because I really want that ship, right? Um, okay, so let's upgrade that. Perfect. Done. That should increase our income. Ah, not really. No, it really didn't do much for us. Uh, yeah, it did. Yeah, it really didn't. It actually costs us money in maintenance, but that's okay. Now, let's just see if we can actually do anything with that with our ship right now. Uh, Tekla. Oh, right here. Shredder rounds and engine boost. Ooh, supercharges the ship's engines with reserve power, giving temporary speed boost. <gasps> that's nice. Uh, that's a good escape. But we can only have four weapon slots. Oh, that sucks. Uh, we can upgrade our homing missile again to level three now. Oh, that's cool. Um, and the other one is the shredder rounds. This rapid firing weapon delivers high speed armor piercing projectiles designed to shred a ship's hull. That might be better than the antimatter beam. Um, I think, actually, I think we're, we're gonna do that because um, the antimatter beam we're going to do that as our second and do the missile as our third. And the reason, uh, and maybe we should upgrade that too. Actually, let's upgrade the missile. 40,000. Oh, no, we don't have enough. All right. So, uh, okay. Peace treaties. Yeah, peace treaties all around. Now, uh, maybe, whew, wow, look at all the bad guys just floating around. Okay, we're going to undock and we're going to go take care of that pirate base. Um, and while we're jumping, we'll take a look at some of this... Uh, propaganda here. So, Santosh Vakram, they were up here, I believe. Uh, Santosh Vakram, yeah, a peace treaty with Halkai. Halkai was getting beat up by both Crystal and Santosh, okay, and uh, let's see, Halkai and Crystal City. So, Halkai is no longer at war with anybody. <laughs> There's a, a, keeping track of di diplomacy is, is a feat on its own. 
I really should uh, maybe start going after Crystal City, but if they retaliate, I have no idea what to expect. Let's kill this pirate base first, because we'll get it. <gasps> oh, crap. Did we drop off our... Son of a... I forgot to drop off our minerals, so let's go sell them at New Brazil. Make some money. Might as well, right? And maybe, yeah, it's get some missions or something on the way or something. Ah, you know, I've decided not to be angry at New Brazil anymore <laughs> um, because, yeah, they're small and they're not going to be as much of a problem. Oh, pirates. Ah, uh, pirate raid. Okay, two pirate raids. Son of a... Well, I'm not going after the pirate raids until we've sold some stuff. <laughs> and again, there's no real consequences to that, so not a big deal, although it does make me angry. I get a little violent. <laughs> Can't help myself! Uh, did I start my timer today? I don't know. Uh, yes, I did. Okay, whew. <laughs> it's, it's sort of a trend. I just forget to do stuff like that. Okay, we're not attacking, guys. We're actually just going to dock and sell some stuff. I'm no longer mad at you. I was just mad that you placed yourself right in the middle of where I wanted to be. So I just want to sell what's in my hold. All right, sell anything that's valuable here anyway. Uh, thorium, good price for that. Titanium, sure. Uh... Yeah, I might as well just clear hold. We're gonna go to the battle right away. Perfect. Undock. Wait! Hold on! I just, uh, just one sec, just one sec. One sec! I wanna see something. I just wanna see something because... Can we... Oh, no, we can't actually sell our city stuff. And, okay, good to know. Um, actually, the other thing I'd like to try... Can we set up a trade treaty with Crydon? <gasps> trade treaty! Offers a trade agreement, grants income bonus for both cities, increases the city's opinion of you, city must be friendly. So, our current in income right now is 2929. If we go trade treaty, yes, trade treaty. 3365, so that gives us an extra, you know, 400, 400 or something? Radar station was raided, we lost 2,000 credits. Eugh. Okay, terrible, but whatever. Um, and that uh, trade treaty gives us plus 20. So that ensures, even even though we're sharing a border, that's, that's actually a really good thing. Okay, good, 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 good. Love it. Let's go attack, uh, hmm. <laughs> hmm. Okay, uh, no, I'm not going to attack that pirate base, but uh, I am going to, ah, uh, see, uh, if, a distress signal. That's for the Crystal City. I guess, I guess we could be friendly with them, but I don't want to. Uh, let's go attack the pirate base. I actually want to go to war because I'm crazy, and that's what I want to do. I actually want to take this pirate base first and then take over the area because uh, that's money. It's cash money in our pocket. Uh, we should go after the comet too. Uh, so much to do! Comets are good because it's just a lot in a very small area. It's just easy. Easy money! I, I, yeah, there we go. Perfect. Slow down, guys. Slow down, slow down. Smash speed. I like the way they explode too. That looks pretty cool. Neat! Okay, and away we go. Uh, let's head to the distress signal. No, let's go to the pirates. Pirates first. Because uh, the pirates, apparently the pirate bases, when they blow up now, there's a lot more materials to collect. So a lot more salvage. So uh, it's, it's, it's a good thing. Uh, we will come in a little... Uh, let's see if we can zoom in a little bit here. And maybe not right on top of the pirate base. Like, yeah, I guess that's as close as we can get without being right on top of them. Oh, uh, well, might as well do that first. <laughs> They're attacking another radar station. Now, I mean, it's not a huge consequence, but it was 2,000 bucks last time. Um, are we just... What's going on here, guys? All right. Make sure we're going in the right direction. Yeah. Whoops. Keep turning off my speed for some reason. Okay, are you with me, guys? Ooh, that's a big asteroid. It looks like something you'd have to dodge, but you can just fly right underneath it. <laughs> All right. Uh, pirates... I said there was pirates here. Attacking something. Here we go. Ah, that's it. Oh, right. Uh, missiles now E. Huh. Oh. That's it. Oh, my guys are too efficient. I didn't even get to play. Come on, guys. Uh, let's just be sure that we're still not under attack. It says we're still under attack, so... Maybe they're actually sitting on top of... Oh, yes. Oh, there we go. Come on. I gotta try the uh, the new weapon. It's good. Oh, look. Lots of bad guys. Okay, so the new weapon is it's just like the plasma thingy, but it's, uh, it's good for hull, so... 
Ah, oh, just missed. So it looked like it didn't actually start the instance until I got close. Which is interesting. Looks like they're working away. Slow down here. I'm pretty sure we won. <laughs> uh, it's so easy to get distracted with stuff when you're on a mission to do something. There's so much going on in the galaxy! Um, but I really want to take care of this pirate base while I still have room in my hold to gather all the goodies. And look, they're about to attack one of my mining bases, so that's not good. So I wonder if I lose minerals if they attack the mining base. That would make sense if we lose minerals if they attack a mining base. I don't know. Don't know if I, until until we actually see it happen. Uh, we only have 130, 134 space left in our... Station. Okay, this this could be an intense battle, so let's pay attention. Missile away. Oh, that 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 other gun doesn't have as much range as I was. It's like I almost like the animator being better, but I don't know. We'll see here. Uh, there we go. Ah, missile hit. Yes. Ooh, that's my butt. Awesome. It's nice having some competent guys to fly with. I really like that. I think we've got him. Just a couple more guys to go here. Missile away. Done. Deal. <laughs> Brilliant. Excellent. I'll take care of these guys. You guys just uh, beat up the station while I clean up some of this mess here. It's just, it's a bit of a pain to target. You almost should have... Uh, so I'm just gonna slow down here. There should almost be two types of targets. There should be a a non-aggressive, like you should be able to target something for salvage as well as for combat. So there should be two different targeting systems. You know what I mean? So that you can salvage at the same time um, and not have to change targets. Ooh, look at all the goodies there. <gasps> Holy crap, 99. Um, yeah, this, we're, yeah, we're not gonna have enough room in our hold for that. Wow, I wonder if we can come back here. How much are we gonna get? Or what types of minerals? Oh, good stuff, osmium. Yes, osmium's always good. Well, let's see if we can go back, drop off, and come back. I guess we could try. Oh, actually, wait, 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 wait. Uh, let's, can we put a radar station down here first? Uh, oh, not in range, hold on. Yes! Oh, awesome. Uh, yeah, okay, let's go. That did free up a little bit of room in our hold, but it'd be a waste anyway. I'd like to come back here. Let's see if we can come back and collect the rest of that stuff. I wonder if it'll still be here. I think it will. <laughs> well, that was good. So, uh, pirate bases are all gone. Uh, did we lose somebody? Uh-oh. Where's Bob? Oh, I forgot to mention! Um, I forget the name. I, I, on the last episode, uh, Emerald, Emerald, the commented something. Emerald, I forget his last name, but uh, the name of the our ship here, my little mother ship here, is Exactica. I requested a name from the community, if you were paying attention, because I put in a secret message, and I requested a name, and he caught the message, and he responded and said, let's name the ship Exactica. So that is the name of our main ship here, so I will now refer to him as Exactica. Oh, okay, so uh, I think everybody's accounted for. Maybe we might be missing somebody. Uh... Not sure. Chimera, level three. Chimera, level three. I think I'll add two level threes, I think. I don't know. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we. I think we just had two. Ooh, I don't know. <laughs> uh, so anyway, yeah, Exactica. That is the name of our ship. I kind of like it. I kind of like it. Works for me. All right, and let's, uh, let's just sell some stuff here because, uh, hmm. Actually, before we do that, let's see if we can upgrade our Tekla. Corporation thing, 40,000, no, 32,000, and we need a lot more uranium. Uh, uranium and titanium and thorium. So let's see, uh, uranium, titanium, so we can sell iridium. Let's sell like all of our iridium and buy, ooh, buying uranium is expensive. Uh, how much do we need? We need another 15 more. So let's just buy 15. Uranium, and then we're good. Okay, so buy 10, buy five, and that should be good. Let's upgrade. Yeah, tech three. All right, so now we're, we're gonna need a bigger hangar. 
Uh, we need a lot of uranium. Oh! <laughs> Uh, let's just sell a bunch of stuff and then we'll go back out here. Uh, worthwhile though, we know. That was easy. That was easy. So I, I want to see the new ship. I'm excited to see it. Let's just sell anything we can that's, uh, we have surplus of. Like, oh, didn't mean to sell at all, but that's okay. Not a big deal because we've got an income of that. Uranium we're going to need more of. So maybe we should actually go visit another city, uh, and see if we can buy some. Crystal City declared war on Valdor. Good thing I'm not Valdor. Uh, Thorium surplus at, uh, Massive influx of thorium at Deluxe, so that, so, it's actually, the, the world is responding to me, so we just sold a whole bunch of thorium in our own city. Oh, holy crap, is that ever cheap? Uh, let's buy everything we can. Holy crap. Okay, so I just, um, it was so cheap, it was like 20. Okay, so I just bought a whole crap load of it. Let's go sell that at uh, at another base, because that's that's easy money. Holy crap. So that was a random event on my city. Crazy. Uh, uh, let's go to... I don't think Brazil had a fantastic price. I just want to check out Mars, because they did have a good price at some point. Whoops, I didn't mean to dock. Um, yeah, look, buy it at 20 and sell it at like 140. That is incredible. Uh, but we have a lot of thorium just kicking around. Now I wonder, as soon as that event is over, will my prices go back to normal? I assume it will, so that was just easy money. We just happened to be in the right place at the right time. That's awesome! Oh, fantastic. Oh, did we repair? I don't think we repaired. Okay, we'll have to repair when we get, uh, when we get here. Because I think one of our guys is pretty injured. Uh, these two guys are fine, but I think the other guy might have been a little bit beat up. Now we need to increase our hangar size, so we're going to need a lot of uranium. We could go mining for it specifically. We haven't done a lot of mining, but it's kind of boring. I don't know, you just fly through the asteroid field and collect. That's all you do, but I don't know. We could do a little bit of that. Uh, I think we have an asteroid field that has uh, thorium rich, osmium rich, no uranium rich, I don't think. Oh, uranium rich! We do have one that's uranium rich, so we could go do some of that. Um, just because uranium's, I don't know. Let's see what the price is here. Maybe we'll buy some here. I don't know. Looking for a good price for thorium first. Let's see. Uh, uh, repair ships and go to market. Uh, thorium. Uh, well, it's not. It's not as good as I was hoping, but I don't know. It's better than nothing. So we'll do that. Uranium price. It's pretty good here. Let's just buy it here. Done. We'll buy fifty. That's great. Um, and uh, yeah, I'm done. I know, we could just go collect it. Why would we do that? But uh, let's go take care of this battle, too, while we're here. Uh, let's jump over there. And what do we got here? So we got Peace Treaty, Valdor, and Crystal City. So Crystal City, surprisingly, has not declared war on us yet. Uh, they, they, they seem to be, like, they're battling with a bunch of people, but not us. And maybe it's because their food size is... I don't know. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Ooh, lots of bad guys. Didn't expect lots of bad guys. I don't like the, uh... The new weapon we have, I, I I don't, I just, yeah, I'd rather have something, whoops, didn't mean to launch more Let's try something different, I think. There we go, and missile away, done. Oh, not quite. Oh, oh, oh. Look at all those missiles coming for him, that's awesome. I love that shield thing though, that is, uh, that's fantastic. Uh, he's dead. <laughs> oh, beautiful fight, beautiful fight. Awesome, guys. Well done. Easy money. Look at all that. Look at all the goodies. Ooh, uranium. That's good. <laughs> we just bought a whole crap load, though. I don't know why we're buying minerals. Unless they're super, super cheap. I, there's really no reason to do that. I just want to double check to make sure we didn't miss any salvage. I don't want to waste too much time. I'm, I'm really enjoying the combat. I don't know, I'm getting better at it too, so maybe that's that's part of the reason why I'm really enjoying it. When you suck at something, it's not as fun. Well, I don't know, it can be fun when you suck at something, but I don't know, it's, it's may, way more fun when you get better at it. Okay, uh, now let's, ooh, pirate raid on their base. Uh, it's good, good for relations. What is our relations with them anyway? Uh, Mars, Mars, Mars. So they are neutral. Uh, it's rising though. Uh, we've come to their aid a couple times. Let's uh, let's maybe get a trade treaty with them too. Uh, and I'm just gonna watch. Ooh, pirate bounty. I like the power bounty too as well. Bounty, not bounty. Uh, because uh, we get we get lots of money for that. 
and it's in enemy territory, so that should be good for us. Alright. Oh! Wow! Okay, really, so we got here too late, but that's not a terrible thing, because we can just uh, collect all the goodies! It's easy money! <laughs> See, this is why I was having trouble after I bought after I bought minerals, I'm like, why did I buy minerals? Because there's so much just lying around. Like it's it's almost too easy. And it doesn't look like, you know, the friendlies or other factions will will actually buy minerals. That's bizarre. Okay, let's go do the pirate raid. Or the uh, bounty, because it's good money for the bounty. And I think we got some uh I'm sure it told us, but I'm sure we got some points. Diplomatic points for them. Oh, no, we didn't. No, we didn't. So, because we actually didn't fight. All right. So, it's, it, actually, it's interesting. So, they were defending, and they we just got there right at the end of the battle. So, that's cool. I like... Now, I like the feeling of the living world in this. I, I mean, even if it's just an illusion, it does feel like this is a living world. It's pretty cool. Uh, I'd like to... Well, I don't know. Okay, hold on. Before I decide what we're going to do, let's deal with our immediate situation. Oops. That was silly. Missile away! Yeah, I don't like that scatter gun or whatever it is. It's, it's just not... Uh... Oh, that was easy. 7,000 bucks for that? Really? Is everybody okay? Like, for 7,000 bucks, and we didn't take any damage? Wow, easy money. Easy money! Uh, how are we doing for hold here? Can we hold anything else? No, we are full. Let's head back home. Oh. Uh, hmm. Oh, we forgot to collect the goodies at the pirate base. I get so distracted! Ah, oh, man! Okay. Mining station was raided. Oh, so we did lose... Okay, yeah, when a mining station gets raided... You lose, uh, you lose the minerals that you're mining as well as money. So that's, it's a double whammy. But big deal, right? If they're not destroying the station, who cares? But I, I guess until, you know, until we start, until, until we have the ability to place defenses of some sort, then really, yeah, I, I, I think it's probably the, probably good that they can't destroy our stations. Although, might make me pay attention more. <laughs> Because, <laughs> you know, that's always a problem. I kind of forget, you know, I focus on what I'm doing right now, but not really focus on what I should add the bigger picture, right? Okay, so let's dock. And, ah, oh, we've got a fair amount of money. Any repairs? A little bit, not very much. Awesome. And we should have enough to upgrade our hangar. Yes! <gasps> level 3 hangar now? Yes, level 3 hangar. That gives us, uh, uh, where is it here? Oh, only one point? Oh, Oh, that sucks. Okay, that gives us a couple... Uh, right. I think, what, level four? <sighs> it only gives us one command point at a time. Okay, so uh, what's it going to cost to buy this new ship? This new fangled Exeter... Or Tekla ship. The Guardian. This is the ship. So level one. Uh, we'll probably upgrade it before we buy it. Because uh, we've got the money to do that. So let's upgrade it first. And now let's... Uh, let's Oh, we need, we need 9,000 credits, so let's just sell whatever we have in our hold here. Uh, whatever we've got extra. Let's just bring everything over there. It makes it a little bit easier to see what's going on. Wow, yeah. Yeah, Thurium, I, I mean, I think the last batch that we bought at our station was like 60-something. So even now, even if we just sell straight out now, like, it was, it was pure profit. Yeah, that's about the lowest I'll go with that. So, yeah, it was pur pure profit. Brilliant. That was really good. Uh, still lots that we can sell there, but that's okay. Let's, uh, what are we going to buy? We're going to buy the ship. The new ship, the Guardian. There we go. We got a Guardian. And uh, can we actually just jam that in there? No, we can't. Okay, so let's get rid of that one. There we go. And can we just throw in it? No, we can't. Uh, so we do need to upgrade our hangar again. So we've got a level 2 and a level 3. Or add another hangar. Ugh. They take up so much space. Um, 33 more uranium. So yeah, let's, uh, ha. Ooh, we need a lot of uranium. Okay, so this is a good opportunity to maybe go do some mining. And we've got our new ship. We're coming, uh, we're, we've got a pretty decent fleet already here. Let's, and, but let's go do some mining. Cause just because we haven't done it yet, let's, let's go do it. And we've got a, we've got a sector that has, that is uranium rich. Exactica. 
interesting name for a ship. I wouldn't have chose that, but it's 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 an interesting name for a ship. I actually kind of like it. Sometimes it's it's important to you know live on the edge, live outside the box, right? Oh, we're almost out of time. Oh, okay, we'll do a little bit of mining here. Yeah, I really want to improve our hang, like improve the size of the fleet that we can drive around with. <gasps> Population minus six. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh, so we're not losing money, but we're definitely not earning as much as we were. Whoops, out of range. Oh man, that's that's thorny. I feel I, I miss the other one that bothers me. It's okay. If, as long as we fly south, we'll run into more. There's more than enough to go around here. There we go. Yeah, I don't know if this is a fast way to mine or to get minerals or not. I mean, I guess if you're looking for something specific, it's not that bad, but it doesn't seem like a super fast way to do things. Like, it seems faster to go and salvage other stuff, sell the other minerals, and then just buy the mineral that you want. You know what I mean? Yeah, we do, we definitely need population. And, and I, I'd, I'd be ashamed to leave without adding more population to our city. Because we've done that on every episode and watched our city grow every episode. So, uh oh, bad guys. Yeah, I'll probably get more uranium from this guy than we are from uh... Missile away! Matching his speed. <laughs> uh, I've got you! I've got you! Look at all those missiles up your bone. So, yeah, the Guardian, he's giving me shield! Oh, I love that ship! That's fantastic! <gasps> Brilliant! Oh, that is a brilliant ship! That's the best ship ever! Oh my god, that is awesome! Okay, well, I'm gonna end the episode here. Um, it has been super fun! And I love the new ship. I love the new ship! Oh, he did some damage. I wish I could give him shields back. Uh, there's probably a device we'll be able to get eventually to do that. But in the meantime, I hope you're enjoying the series, and we will see you in a couple days. Alright, take care, guys.